Welcome to Kid Bits, a place where kids learn to be creative thinkers. I'm your host, Zoe Brown. During this bedtime book adventures, we will be reading Good Night Football by Michael Dahl, illustrated by Christina Forshin. Good Night Football. It's the end of the week. It's the best of all sights. Beneath the night sky lies a field of bright lights. And the bleachers are full for a very good reason. The big game is tonight. It's football season. The big band plays and the cheerleaders shout. And everyone te- cheers as the teams run out. The fans are excited. It's time for some fun. Then a whistle, the kickoff, the game has begun. On third and one, the ball is snapped. But the defense breaks through and the quarterback is sacked. He shakes it off and gets up. The crowd yells, hooray! Then the team huddles up and discusses a play. The quarterback drops back and lets the ball go. It sails through the air. Oh, what a throw! A receiver breaks loose and stands all alone. He reaches up, grabs the ball. He's in the end zone! The teams trade positions. Up and down rolls the score. Then a long one runs the game. Hear the crowd roar! What a game! What a night! Good night, players. You fought a good fight. Good night, coaches, as they shake hands. Good night, cheerleaders. Good night, band. Good night, bleachers. Good night, fan. Good night, fan. Good night, field and con station fans. Stands. Good night, mascot. We'll come back soon. Good night, goalposts. Good night, moon. Good night, helmet, and my favorite teams. Good night, football. Good night, and sweet dreams. The end. That was a great book to read before for a bedtime story. I'll see you next Wednesday at 8 p.m. Central for Kid Bits with Zoe Brown Bedtime Book Adventures. Good night.